It's time for the Team Obama Spotlight. Today, the spotlight shines on an appointee named Aponte. ALG's Don Todd has the tale of this Obama teammate. On December 9th, 2009, uh, President Obama appointed Marie del Carmen Aponte as ambassador to El Salvador. She'd uh, previously been appointed by President Clinton and did not make it through the nomination process because she had had a cozy, cohabitational relationship with a Cuban spy for eight years, from whom she borrowed money and did not pay back. And she refused to take polygraph tests about it. And she refused to answer uh, questions about it, refused to cooperate with the FBI. This is known as giving aid and comfort to the enemy. Now they want to send her down to El Salvador, where we had a communist revolution going on not too long ago, and we had people on both sides. We aided people on the anti-communist side, and she's going to have access to all those files about who fought the communists in El Salvador. What do you think she'll do with them? The El Salvadorians are upset, as evidenced by a letter they sent to Senator DeMint. We respectfully request that Ms. Aponte be removed from post as soon as possible so that El Salvador may enjoy the benefits of having a person as a government representative of your noble country. Does it ever end? <laughs> this administration, I mean, it's just bizarre that they would, they would appoint somebody of that nature. And that's something that hasn't escaped the El Salvadorians' notice, too. It has escaped the public's notice. Okay, so Team Obama wanted this woman to be a U.S. ambassador when she was literally sleeping with the enemy. And yet again, it seems they're helping out the people who hate us. Oh, oh geez, bad piece of video there.